Hi guys, this is Saurav. In this video, we will learn how we can animate component in MIT App Inventor. There is no default option to animate the components like buttons, images like that. But we can use extension to animate the, all these things. Okay, so here we see the example first. So here you can see that's the app here. We will create this app and here that one is JPG image and we are using your extension to animate this image like this. Okay, so how we can do this? Let's see. Here we go. Now we need to click on a start new project. We are using your MIT App Inventor to create this app and that name is animation. Okay, animation image or animate image fine now so that's the screen right so now here I'm going to use one image so in the left side you will find your image option just drag and drop this image and I'm going to make this height uh, at least 30, 300 pixel and make this with is 300 pixel like this fine now click on screen and now make it align horizontal to center align vertical to center like this Okay, now I'm going to use your one button to animate the image or you can use directly animate this image using the uh, initialize screen option, right? So whenever someone, whenever someone open your app, like so when screen one dot initialize, then we have to animate our image. So for that, we have to use one extension. First, we will use one image here because there is no image, so we, we can't see the animation, right? So click on this image, click on picture option, click on upload file, and click on choose file. I already have one image, that one is tap image. You find here, you can use this component and you can use that technique uh, for in a player app, music player app, okay? So that one is simple image, right? So we have to uh, make this animate. So we will do here one thing that first we need to install the extension. So in the app inventor extension Pure Vida, you will find your animation extension. I already have, I will give you the link of this extension in the description. Or you can download this extension from the here, okay? PureVidaApps.com website. Now, in the left side, you will find extension option, click on import extension, click on choose file, okay? And uh, I already have that one animation click on import fine in the left side you'll find animation animation so just drag and drop this one fine and in the go to the block section and click on animation and we have to animate image here right so you will find your image option this one called animation dot image just drag and drop this here banner or uh, screen will in a slide so we have two animate our image so we will use here this image one so click on image and just drag and drop this image here is the input so which component you want to animate so we are going to animate image one here okay if you have suppose two images so you can select any other image like this now duration for time so we are using your maths function just drag and drop this and we will use duration it's something around 30,000 okay 1000 it means one second okay so make sure you have to uh, you have to put value according to your requirement so i'm going to copy paste this one and drag and drop here i have to change the value okay for all this thing and this one make it zero and copy paste two times more like see now uh, that's the rotation so i'm going to put here five four double zero value and uh, start delay zero scale zero scale should be one okay and scale y should be one and alpha should be one and trans translate uh, translation y zero and that x also zero and make it rotation five four double zero fine let's run this app how how this will work okay click on connect i am using your emulator to run this app so here you can see that's the example you can find you will find here that image is rotating right now right so let's uh, refresh this campaign and you will see here now image is rotating see so that's the simple image and we are rotating this image using that extension right so that's very easy way 
to create this app you can use here one media player or player and and make a media player app using this uh, this technique okay so that's very easy way to create this app if you have any doubt you can ask me on command please don't forget to subscribe my channel like this video share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye